Hello and welcome to your third HTML tutorial in a series of HTML tutorials. If you have not seen the first or second, I suggest going back and watching them. Um, so if you have, you should open up the one you opened in the last uh, tutorial. And it should look something like what we had before. I just started new so that um, I wouldn't get messy over time. So I'm going to open it up in Firefox and Notepad. Uh, let's just let it open up in Firefox. There we go. Get rid of these. Okay. Um, so first off, uh, what I'm going to do is today I'm going to be going over positioning, um, things on the screen, and hyperlinks. So first off, um, I'm just going to type hello in here. I'm going to save that, and I'm going to refresh. Now see how the text is here. Well. Maybe I want it to go over here. Let's say over here. Well then, the way you do that is by creating a div tag. I'm not sure if I mentioned this in one of my other tutorials. It basically doesn't do anything by itself. You have to add um, special properties to it. But as you can see, I saved and refreshed it and nothing changed. But what the div tag basically does, it just um, separates certain parts of text from others. So, or it's almost like selecting it, almost like highlighting it. And um, so, what we're going to do is to position it. Position it is to the right of the V of div. Make a space. Type style equals open quotation position colon absolute and semicolon and space top colon, then however many pixels you want from the top, make mine 100 px. Another semicolon. Um, after that we're going to go to uh, another space, do left, colon, then do, uh, I'll do 500 pixels, and then we can just close the quotation, save that, fresh over here, and as you can see, it moved it 100 pixels down, 500 pixels to the right. Now, um, just to show you that I can also move it around, I'm going to make 100 into 50, or 50, and make 500 into 400. I'm going to save that, save that, um, refresh here, and as you can see, now it's 50 pixels down, uh, five, or 400 pixels to the right. Um, basically, what it means by top is it means from the top, so 100 pixels from the top or 50 pixels from the top so it really means down 100 pixels or down 50 pixels and from the left it means from the left 100 pixels or 500 pixels and so it basically means right 500 pixels I know it's kind of opposite but that's how they, uh, they worded it uh, now what we're going to go over is anchor tags I mean um, hyperlinks which are defined in anchor tags Anchor tag is left pointing arrow, A, right pointing arrow, then the text you want to click on, such as YouTube, then close the anchor tag, then to the right of the A, make a space and type href ref equals open quotation, the exact website, so I would copy and paste the link, http, tp, uh, regular colon, slash slash www.youtube.com and end quotation now after you make sure you have spelled that correctly and you have what you want to click you can save this refresh and as you can see now it's clickable and I'm going to click on that and it's going to open up uh, what's it called YouTube and um, now I'm going to have it open up Google I'm going to change this to Google. And I'm going to change this to Google. Google. I save that. Refresh. And there we go. Google. Um, so that's basically all we're going to go over in this tutorial. Um, oh, what you can also do is instead of having it go to a website, you can have it go to an image. So, um, say in uh, my desktop which I have uh, right here 
I can open up this and as you can see I have an image in here so right next to my HTML file so I can instead of typing google.com I can type in the name of the file which is magicforest02.jpg so magicforest02.jpg and I'm just going to change this to image um, I'm going to save that and then I'm going to open up Firefox and refresh and as you can see now it says image and when I click on that it will bring me to the uh, picture and I'll show you that when I open this up is in fact the picture. Now there's another way that you can do it which is show it on the screen and I'll go over that in the next tutorial. This is just a hyperlink to it so it brings you to the source. Um, so thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you have any questions you can always talk to me on my AIM account which is CP Answer Man and um, right here and if you have any questions or video requests, you can talk to me on this or send me a PM. Uh, please comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and bye.